is for people who are who are selfless. Let's think about Nigerians first before anything. Mm. So in whether he won't be president or, or whatever, leave that ambition. Let us see amongst ourselves who and who we want to back. We all will line behind that person. Yeah? So we can have a good fan base. Right. At the end of the day, I discovered that it was, they are not there because of Nigeria. They are not there because, you know, they want a better environment. They are there for their own bloody selfish reason. Some people want to, to dust off their CV. Some people were sent by the APC and PDP to come even scatter us. Some people were just collecting money because it's an election season and some people must make money. At the, at, the, at the whatever of the masses, they don't care. So I was very disappointed that after all the talk and all the consultation for over three to four weeks, that this is what we, Naim I say, up no good, down no good. My side now, so so put up, put up, I didn't see. Were you surprised that um, Dr. Obi was joined the race? I was surprised, but these days, I don't say, I, I can't say whether they surprise surprised again because nothing they surprise me. Okay, you can imagine that one jumping in, jumping out. What, 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 what and then the next. <laughs> No sooner had he jumped, now she jumped out, then the vice, her vice declared for, wow. for Buhari. Yeah. So what is going on? So that means that these people, some of the people we can't do meeting with me, they already doing this somewhere. Maybe they came to that meeting to record what we are talking and to see how they can further, you know, yeah. fragment us. So this is what's on the ground and that is why I'm saying we're looking beyond 2019, 2019 because we just lost it. Because it will still be these same people who have ruined this country will still be in charge. And that is why this change that we're hoping that we'll see, it may not be in my lifetime. We may not be the one that will enjoy it. It may not even be our children. but. I'm happy for the fact that it has started. Something has started. And I want to remind everybody, the, the, the struggle that we're involved in mm. is a marathon race. You didn't hear me so? Yes. Marathon. You know what the marathon being now? Yes, I know. It's not a sprint. It's not a dash. We'll only be lucky if the young... Me, as an area father, what is my job? And I mean, they escort these people. They work everywhere. Mm. My job is to look for... To, to be able to dig out exceptional people. Mm. And I know that they exist in Nigeria. They do. We are not all criminals. We are not all thieves. Mm -hmm. Okay? We can't be all bad. But it's because we've allowed the worst of us to lead the best of us. That is why we're having the weaponized hunger. Mm. Which is where I'm education. going. How they've can... spoiled everything because we've been sleeping. How can we deal, or how can Nigeria deal with the issue of poverty? When you look at it during campaigns, people go there for one cup of rice, mm -hmm. 500, as little as 500 Naira people gather at places of campaign. How can Nigeria deal with the issue of poverty? I'm not going to have the mic. Madmo, answer. <laughs> <laughs> More Madmo. 